Welcome to this tutorial on the Surface Renderer in Huygens. This tool is available for Huygens Essential and Professional. The Huygens Surface Renderer is a powerful 3D visualization tool that enables the visualization of ESO surfaces of volumes. In the Huygens software, in this case Professional in Night Theme mode, we open and select the image we want to visualize. Right click on the image and go to View and select Surface Renderer to open the Surface Renderer. Now the Surface Renderer window will pop up. Within the window you see a large view of the object. First we are going to adjust the color of channel 0 because this is the blue channel. You can find the option to change the color range next to the data channel selection in the object segmentation panel. In this panel you can also adjust the threshold, meaning the intensity for which the ESO intensity surfaces are defined. The seed, only objects with an intensity higher than the seed level remain, while the rest are discarded. The garbage volume, volumes that contain less voxels than the fitted parameter will not be rendered. This is useful for rendering only significant objects in noisy images. Transparency and brightness of the selected pipe. In total three render pipes allow us to define three parameters that can be applied onto the same or to different data channels. Now we are going to select a different channel in the second pipe. We select channel 1 and leave the color and the other parameters as they are. We are also going to add a different channel in the third pipe. We select channel 3. and change the color to red. Within the window you can adjust the magnification by using the zoom slider or by using the scroll wheel. The viewpoint can be adjusted by moving the tilt and twist sliders or by dragging the mouse pointer on the large view. Or you can enter the twist or tilt value by clicking on the buttons and enter the one to twist or tilt in degrees. You can use the middle mouse button to pan the center of the projection. Adjust to view as satisfactory. In the options menu you can find some option about quality and size of the rendered object as well as enable or disable the bounding box, scale bar and SVI logo. The animation options can be used for creating a simple movie of the render. The next file menu can be used to save the scene. It is also possible to load and save templates for next usages. Like mentioned earlier, it is possible to generate a simple movie in the renderer. Under the movie tab you set a first and last scene and click the create animation button in the bottom right corner of the window. You can change some basic settings like amount of frames and frame rate. In order to create a more sophisticated movie please see the Huygens Movie Maker tool. In the bottom right of the screen you can also adjust the quality of the renders. There are two modes, fast and high quality. Back at the segmentation tab it is also possible to add, besides the surface pipes, the maximum intensity projection pipe. The MIP of a channel can be used as a spatial reference for the objects present in other channels. There is also the slicer pipe. This pipe represents a single slice of the 3D data set in its corresponding location. You can do this for X, Y, and Z. This was the tutorial on the Surface Renderer in Huygens. For more information on how to use each visualization option, please consult the specific tutorial. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us.